Well, here we are again. Um, ISO episode 3, 4, or whatever it is. Um, <laughs> oh dear. Uh, it, it's, it, it is funny. I, I don't know what's the matter with people. Um, I've had another round this morning about with somebody, um, um, Mr. Viana. Um, I don't know where he's from, Mexico or whatever. My apologies if I got the country wrong. Um, that it, he's now claiming there's a bug. My God, this this camera's got so many bugs; it's ridiculous. Um, I think what a bug is 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 a bug of the human brain. I do not understand something, so I am going to accuse this camera of being bug ridden. <coughs> Oh my god. Yes, I don't understand, so it's a bug. Um, okay, apparently he, he's put his ISO in the I menu. And it doesn't work properly. Um, he can't understand why, it's a, so it's a bug. So he, he's, he's written to um, Nikon. Okay, so they're going to just come back and tell him how to do it, I guess, and tell him there is no bug. So what I did, what I've done, I've gone into my camera. Well, let me turn it on. And um, I've put it in the eye menu. Okay, so there we go. ISO sensitivity settings. If I press a button, oh look. Oh, my ISO changes when I put it in here. Now, how comes mine changes and his wouldn't? Well, if you look at the top of the camera, it's in C. Now, C stands for control. Um, that's why it's a C. Automatic begins with an A. That's why... That is not an A, because it's not automatic. It means control. So when you put it in C, and you have your ISO in the amount I menu, you can control it with your I with your within the menu. You can control your ISO. Now, if I switch this over and turn this to ISO two hundred. And then go back into the eye menu. You will see. Oh, it's uh, oh, where are we? You will see it says ISO two hundred. But when I click the OK button, nothing happens. And if you can see, it's greyed out because I'm controlling it with the dial. Okay, so. Basically, if you put it in C, you are then controlling it yourself from something other than the dial. If you're controlling it with the dial, then you're not controlling it with anything else. You are simply controlling it from the dial. That, Mr. Viana, is not a bug. That is just how it works. Not difficult. Now, for God's sakes, people, if, if you don't... You know, what's the matter with these people? Do, do you want there to be a bug in this camera? Do you want something to be wrong with it? If you don't understand something, then reach out to people and find out if... How something there's normally a simple if you don't understand something, there is normally a simple explanation as to why it doesn't work. Okay, it's normally a simple explanation, it doesn't mean there's a bug or there's something wrong with it. Just because you don't understand it doesn't mean there's something wrong with it. Now we've got out of the camera and Mr. Viana, who don't understand something, so automatically presume there's a bug. 
they've got some obsession with there must be a bug with the camera because I'm I'm a bit stupid. I don't understand it. So I haven't got the brains to work out to reach out to somebody and find out if I'm doing something wrong. I will just go to Nikon and tell them there's a bug in my camera. Now, for all those people that think there's a bug in the camera, listen, there are some very professional people that have had hold of this camera. Believe me, if there was a bug or there was something wrong with the camera, these people would have sussed that out very, very quickly. And none of those people have commented on any bugs or problems. And, and they would. They would automatically... I can guarantee people far more qualified than me would know there was an issue with this camera. And would it would be all over the internet. And Nikon would have withdrawn the cameras and fixed it before they reissued them. That hasn't happened because there is no problem. The only problem is people's lack of understanding. Now, we've all been there because, you know, this can happen with any camera. All, all cameras have their little quirks and hidden menu things that are a little bit more difficult to understand at first sight. So you just have to learn. You learn off of other people or just by playing with the camera and you, you'll suss out how it works. But don't go around assuming because you don't understand something, there is a bug. Oh, dear. I, I, <laughs> I don't suppose this will be the last uh, video I do on the ISO issue. I've got a feeling I will be doing another one. And possibly another one after that. But we shall see. Till the next one.